Hi, this is Jennifer with Brome Fields, and I just want to show you a quick video on how I increase a stitch using the backwards loop. So I just slip that forward and put it on my needle and pull tightly. And do that again. Push forward and pull. You do want to pull it pretty, kind of make that stitch a little tight because it will create a little bit of a gap in your work. Sometimes this is, is nice, like whenever you're knitting um, a fingerless glove where you have a thumb gusset or a sweater. I, I prefer this backwards loop because then I can go back and stitch it up to close up that gap if I want to and it doesn't create a notch in the front of my work. So you can see where I have my pearls and my knits. And you can see that's my increase stitch, my knit two stitches, my increase stitch with the purl. So it still looks like the purl stitch with the bar in the front. And then that looks like a knit stitch with even just with the backwards loop. So I hope you found that helpful and explanatory for the increased stitch. Thank you.